So today we're actually going to be doing a collaboration makeup tutorial and I collaborated with one of my best friends on YouTube and in real life. Her name is Sonia and I'm sure a lot of you know who she is but just in case you don't I'm gonna link you guys to the video of the look that she did ex almost exactly like this one. So we decided to do a collaboration and we tweeted a lot of you to tweet us like your favorite celebrity looks and stuff. But we found it somewhat difficult to kind of choose a celebrity to do a tutorial on. So she came up with the idea that we should do one of each other's looks. And I decided to do one of her most recent tutorials, which was the Katy Perry California Girls inspired makeup tutorial that she has. And I'm sure a lot of you guys are going to go and see it. And I'm sure a lot of you have already because it's gotten a lot of views. As soon as I saw it, I was like, oh my god, this is so cute. Like, I'm all over it. It has purple glitter. Purple is one of my favorite colors. And it looks really, really great, like, on every single skin tone. So I decided to do it. And and she's going to do one of my looks, and I'm not going to tell you which one because you're going to have to wait and see hers. But as soon as hers goes live, I'm also going to link you to the video that she's doing of one of my looks. And you can also check that out, and I'll also have the link of their original. So, um, just like I'm going to link you guys to her original, and then obviously you're going to see mine. Also, I want to see you guys' video response to this video creating this exact same look I think it's a lot of fun because it shows you that even if you don't have the same products you can almost create like the exact same thing so I just want to take a few seconds to talk about the glitter which is um I know I'm gonna get a lot of questions she used the Makeup Bella um, cosmetic glitter and I still happen to have it too which looks like that comes in a little can little tub little can <laughs> and um, you can find it at the mall in a little like little cart. Um, also, if you go to Ulta, they have LA Splash Cosmetics and they have cosmetic glitter, and this is the Phenomenon. And it just looks like that purple glitter. And Sally's Girl, um, if you are wondering about the adhesive for the glitter, you can find it at Sally's Beauty Supply, and it's by Sally's Girl. And it comes in a little tube like this, it's only like a dollar. And then they have loose glitter also in many different colors um, like purple and blue and gold and stuff but here's the purple not this one but here's another purple and then last but not least if you do not find any glitter anywhere you can check eBay I bought like a bunch of different pigments and glitters like I think about a year and a half ago and like two years actually but they're still there. I've seen them. If you just kind of like search for cosmetic glitter, you're going to get like all these little tubes, little cans. I don't know what to call these. Tints, whatever. Okay, you're going to get a lot of, a bunch of these. You're going to see them. Very inexpensive and you get like so many different colors too. And they're called Lamine. Lamine. But it doesn't matter the name because they're going to be there. You're going to know what it is. So anyways... That's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. It's really, really fun and such a pretty look. I'm actually going to go and buy some stuff to make cupcakes. And I'm actually going to take this makeup out. Because it's like, if you take the glitter out, it's super wearable. Let me just give you a close-up. It's so pretty. And there's the light brown that she was talking about. It's kind of peeking out. So I hope you guys get a chance to try it out, and I can't wait to see your video response. And don't forget to check out um, Sonia, which is Essie Castaneda on YouTube. You're going to love her, because she's like my bestie, and I love her so much. So anyways, that's it, and talk to you guys later. Bye! We're taking Too Faced Shadow Insurance, and we're going to apply this all over the eyelid. So now I'm taking my MAC 239, and it's just a flat eyeshadow brush, and I'm going to go in to Vanilla and it's just a highlight and this is going to go right underneath your eyebrow just like this for a highlight you can work this all the way around like that and then just blend it down so now we're taking a MAC um, 217 and then we're going to go into texture just like a light soft brown and this you want to place on your brow bone. So from the outer corner you can start and then just kind of bring it in. Just switch the angle of the brush. So like this and then you can flip it and go right here. 
Now we're taking this quad, and this is by Kiss, and we're going to take like this almost plum purple. And the reason I like it is because it has like brown undertones. Let's just kind of sweep this on the eyelid. And this without the glitter could be like a very wearable daytime look. Just pack it in there. Just like that. And now for the fun part, which is the glitter. Um, you're going to need glitter adhesive, and you can find this at Sally's Beauty Supply, and this is by Sally's Girl. Um, all you want to do is, well, what I like to do is just take a brush, but you can also take your finger. But I'm going to take a flat brush like this one with synthetic bristles, and then just kind of grab a little bit and place that on your brush. Like this. Just kind of set that aside and get the glitter that you're going to be using ready. Using cosmetic glitter, and this is by Makeabella. This is such a beautiful, beautiful um, purple glitter. You can see it. It's so pretty and it's very, very fine. It's not chunky at all. All I'm going to do is just kind of place this on the eyelid. This is the adhesive, and you want to work with it fast because you don't want it to dry completely. Okay, and then just go into the glitter and just pick some up with your brush. And for this, you're going to need um, something to hold the fallout because you're going to get lots and lots of fallout. Um, so I'm just going to take like this cardboard paper and this is actually a tag. And then we're just going to pat the glitter on to the eyelid just like that and while it dries a little bit so we can do the eyeliner we are going to fill in our eyebrows and I like to use my Anastasia brunette brow powder and then just fill it in every time I do a tutorial that has like a lot going on in the eye area. I love to do my eyebrows because it really completes them. So I just lightly fill them in like this and then brush them. And then you can take brow gel. And this is also by Anastasia. And just kind of wipe off the excess on the rim because this could really harden up your eyebrows. I've been in love with this Physicians Formula Trio lately. Like they're very, very creamy. This is especially for brown eyes. So you have the brown, purple, and then black. I'm gonna take the black one and I'm also taking my favorite eyeliner brush. And this is by Sonia Kashuk. We're just gonna go in here. You can tell it has a little bit of glitter, but I'm just gonna rub that. The top eyelid. This is just a lot easier for me to work with. We're taking um, CoverGirl's Lash Blast Fusion and we're going to do one coat on the top and on the bottom lashes. I'm just going to take some glue and this is the Duo Eyelash Adhesive. This is waterproof. And I'm just going to take some on my MAC palette, make sure it's clean, like this. We're going to let that get tacky. And while the glue gets a little tacky, just taking some double-sided tape. And I'm just going to lightly pick up any fallout of the glitter. So your face is not like completely glittery. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the cheeks and for the cheeks I'm using Refined Golden and it's just a really pretty bronze. It's similar to NARS Laguna and every time I use this I always say that it's very very similar and I like to take my MAC 131 goat hair and that picks up less product so you, so you don't get like streaks or anything like that. So I am actually going to bring this all the way up to my temples. So for the lips, I am actually going to use um, Pearly Pink 
And this is a new lipstick that came out with Maybelline. It's a really pretty pink. And even though it's pearly, it's not metallic looking. It's not like ultra pearly looking. So that's why I really like it. Because a lot of pearls or metallics, they tend to bring a lot of attention to my lips. And especially right now that I have all this glitter on, I don't want that. So I'm actually just going to pat this down. Finish it off with a really pretty um, lip gloss. And the lip gloss that I'm using today has, it's kind of like um, corally looking. This is called Easy Lounger. And I think I believe I used this, actually I did use this lip gloss on my last tutorial. And the reason for that, that I'm using it today, is because I want... I don't want like super bright pink lips. I just want like pinky, pearly, orangey lips. Just like that. That pretty much completes the whole makeup tutorial. Really pretty, really bright um, purple and it's just the way that I like it. I am absolutely like in love with this look. So hopefully you guys get a chance to try it out. It's really, really easy and don't forget to check out um, Sonia's video which is going to be linked down below so you can see the look that she did which is very 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 similar to this one so anyways I will talk to you guys later and thanks for watching bye